hey guys how are you doing welcome to today's tutorial so in today's tutorial i'm going to be teaching us, us how to effectively cut a pocket and attaching it to a pants trouser just the way you see it on the thumbnail okay but before we do kindly subscribe if you have not and if you have subscribed i want to say a very big thank you if you have not we encourage you to do let us start we are going to do the pockets so i pick up the front panel of my trouser put both of them together and then try to arrange them arrange it properly by pinning it down pin it down all right so this is the waist area you're going to measure 2.5 inches here on this waist area okay 2.5 inches or two and a half inches whichever one is convenient for you and then position it like this okay two and a half then you measure eight and a half here okay eight and a half so it's two and a half eight and a half you get your curve and then you position it like this the reason why we are using this curve is so that the pocket we have it with, with the pocket to the fanciful okay it's not just straight all the way straight okay if you want it straight like this if you want it straight like this if you want it to be straight or slanty you can use your long ruler and do it this way if you want it straight or slanty you can do it this way okay but me i like it this way because it's a female trouser it's to me this is finer and you know more fanciful okay you're going to have something like this you see how beautiful this pocket looks okay something like this you see this curve is what makes it beautiful okay so that's what this is a short palazzo a short palazzo you see so that's what makes this pocket beautiful all right so I haven't um, I haven't gotten the shape you just cut it out just cut it out right So this is what you have this is the pockets area now huh? so we are going to you get a fabric like this okay you measure you know we have taken away two and a half inches you have to replace it back the two and a half inches coupled with the space for the pocket and then the sewing allowance so all of that you have to make have enough fabric that we cover all of that so right now i have nine inches here the length here is nine inches for the pocket nine inches and then the depth the depth of the pockets 
half 12 and half 12.5 okay so it's 9 inches and then 12 by 5 and then you cut it in two places because the pockets you have to space for the pockets hope you understand so we are going to take it to the sewing machine now so that i show you how to fix the pockets so this is one piece for the pockets okay you open it this is the front part okay there are other ways of fixing of you know achieving this pocket fixing but this is one of the simplest way that has worked for me and for um, other of my students okay on a good day i'm supposed to this shape we made as we created out um, we are supposed to you know also create out the same shape on the fabric the pocket fabric that we've cut out and all of those but i don't want you to be confused okay that's why i've left it like this if you follow this pattern you are good to go so this is one of the pockets you just pick this up you know i refuse to shape this under part to form that pockets that pop that shape you usually gets you know beneath the pockets i refuse to do all of those when you have succeeded in fixing the pockets you can do all of those shaping okay i just want you to get because fixing of pockets on trousers is a difficult task for a lot of people all right so i want you to get it right you pick up this fabric one of the piece this is the front part you place it here front part facing the front part okay you turn it this way remember it was two and a half inches we cut out of this part you place it like this already it has formed your two and a half inches but to be double sure you measure to be sure that is the same two and a half inches that you took away from your trouser is what you are replacing back hope you understand so we have our two and a half inches i'll just pin it down okay and then you cut it out all right after cutting out you sew you sew using either quarter of an inch or half inch to sew After sewing, you open it up and top stitch, okay, so that it relaxes properly. Although you are going to give it a very good ironing, so you are top stitching on the pocket side, not on the trouser side, okay. After top stitching, 
watch carefully you turn it in this way okay hope you understand you bring this pockets inside this way and then we are also going to top stitch on this part although this what we are going to do right now is optional but the top stitching we are going to do right now on this part is to add a kind of beauty to the pockets the outer pockets hope you understand it's optional but i will advise that you adopt it okay you use a tiny stitch to do this you sew on it you can use like quarter um quarter of an inch or 0 0.35 you know to do the sewing This really adds beauty to the pockets. After sewing that, already the pocket is taking a shape. You see your pocket is taking a form but we are not done you open it and then you flip it this way okay you flip it that way then you come down here bringing both ends of the pocket together like this okay you can pin if you want to all right you bring this end together we are going to sew from here we are going to sew from here we am chalking now you create a curve bring it down here did you see what I just chucked hmm did you see are you seeing the chalk we are sewing from here create a curve and bring it down here okay bring it down here down here is where you bring it down here okay So where you ended your sewing you just notch it a little that way and then you trim off this then you turn it inside out we're going to top stitch on it so that the pocket does not get 
loosened okay we're just going to do a top stitch on it this is just for you to secure your pocket it does not get loose That when you put your money or your phone in your pocket, none of it will fall out. Okay. So after doing that, turn it back. That way. And then. You position it like this. This is the inner part now. You've created it. It's very easy, very simple. Very, very simple. If you follow the steps, you see, your pocket is ready. Very, very ready. This is it. It's ready. So if you measure now, you will see that you have your two points five inches that you cut out remember it was 2.5 inches we cut out what we have here is three inches so we have an extra of 0 0.5 inch which you can cut out or use it as part of our sewing allowance the more reason why you should use nine inches okay if you use anything short of nine inches you're you are going to be short of the measurement you initially measured out when we're doing your cutting okay hope you understand so i'll just pin it down okay and then we'll come here down here to secure the fabric to our pockets here yeah. you just make a small sewing here to hold this pocket to to hold your trouser to this pocket fabric hope you understand just like that also come here up here and run a straight stitch to hold this trouser down to this inner pockets hope you understand so hold this trouser down to the trouser down to the inner pockets Okay. Just a loose stitch. Hope you cannot fix a pocket. If there is any part of this tutorial video, if there's any part of this tutorial you do not understand, please drop your question on the comment section below. You can even call me for um, more explanations, okay? Like this video, share it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed, please kindly subscribe, okay? So the same way you fixed here, our pocket is set. You see? Ready? Beautiful. The same way you fixed here is the same way you're also going to fix the other side. 